Hello guys, in this video tutorial, we will tell you how to add the map feature to your app. Log into your account and go to your business dashboard. Next, click on manage app and you'll be redirected to the overview page. Next, click on edit under the edit test and go live section. Now to add the map feature, click on the add feature button in the sidebar. Then click view all and search map. Click on the feature to add it to your app. Once you added the feature, you will see the feature listed in my feature section where you can edit, customize, and organize your added features the way you want. Now hover over the feature and you will have options to show hide the feature, edit and customize the feature, delete the feature, and move the feature. Now let's check out all what you can do with the newly added map feature. Click on the pencil icon here to edit and customize the feature. This is your page or feature name. If you want, you can change it as per your needs. From here, you can change the feature icon. If you want, you can select a solid icon or an outline icon or an image from a library or upload your own custom icon image. You can even upload two different images for the mobile app and website. Let's move to the content section now. This section lets you add the exact location of your businesses or branches. This is your address menu name. You can change the name as per your needs. From here, you can change the address menu icon. You can select an icon from my library or upload your own custom icon image. Now here you will see two options for adding an address. You can either add an address by entering the complete address using the mailing address option, or you can provide the locations latitude and longitude. First, let's add a mailing address. Specify the complete address with the city and country name here. Once done, you can view the address on Google Map here. Now let's add an address via the latitude and longitude option. Enter the latitude and longitude coordinates in the respective fields to add an address. As soon as you enter the latitude and longitude, you will see a map window below where you can check and verify your specified location on the map. Next, click on the add more button to add multiple addresses. From here, you can delete the address. Now let's change the layout and color scheme of the map feature. Click on this color palette icon here to change the page style and color scheme. From here, you can set the page elements, color, font size, and indent. You can even make the fields rounded and hide the field icon by enabling these toggles if you want. Now let's move on to the in-app purchase section and enable in-app for this feature. Click the in-app settings icon in the side menu. Then under in-app settings, enable the in-app toggle and provide the necessary credentials in the required fields. Please note, you can enable in-app for both Android and iOS. To get the credentials, you can click on the question mark icon and refer to our tutorial. After providing the credentials, you can use them as global credentials by checking this checkbox here. Please note, you can also add new credentials if you want. Once you're done, click on save to save the changes manually or directly click the publish button to see the reflection of your latest updates on your mobile app. That's all for now. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get the latest updates as soon as they are live.